okay so i'm so excited um i have been waiting i ordered these okay but i didn't say this is what the I'm so excited. Can you tell? Hi, my name's Liz. I don't have an intro. So if you're not new here, you know that. If you are new here, I don't have an intro and I burp in every video. And I don't say that to be like <laughs> quirky and relatable. No, like I literally burp in every single video. Um, and my acid reflux is a problem. Anyway, that's besides the point because today I'm trying Rare Beauty. I ordered it when it went on the site at midnight and I got it on Sephora. <sighs> and it hurt my bank account. Did I say what this was? I don't even want to look at my receipt, but it was over $100. And I justified it by being like, I don't know. I can't really justify it. I haven't been this excited about a makeup line since like ever. I think this is actually makeup that I'll actually use. And I love the mission behind it and the Rare Impact Fund. Just, I'm so excited. Like I literally can't take, I can tear myself. I can't even speak full sentences because I'm so excited. I just want to put it on my face. So we're just going to start. I'm going to stop talking. Actually, no, I'm not. By the way, these clips, they're resin clips. And my friend Karina has a resin little shop. Um, so go to resinrina.com. First up, we have the Liquid Touch Foundation. Um, I didn't get the primer because I needed to save some money in my bank account. Also, I don't know if I got the correct shades. The only reason I got this shade is because the model was also a redhead and more pale, like me. So I was like, okay, I'll get what she's wearing. Um, so yeah, I got the shade 110N. I've never done like a review video, but I was thinking I could do like one half with a beauty blender and then one half with a brush. Put my beauty skills to the test. I heard that this was to make it more accessible to open, so really love that. I just love the thought that went into this. How do I do this? Oh my god, oh my god. I'm so excited. A beauty blender first. This is the one by Beauty Bakery. Oh my god, wait. Wait a minute. Wait, what the? Do you see that? First of all, a little goes a long way. Second of all, can you see how good that looks? I have really dry skin. Listen, I had high expectations for this and this just really exceeded everything. Holy shit. I'm gonna try a brush. Yeah, I like a sponge better. So, oh my. Are you kidding me? It like melts right into your skin. And this is such a good color. If this wears like everybody says it does, and it like wears really well, this is the best foundation I've ever tried in my entire life. It literally feels like there's nothing on my face. Oh my god, I look insane because my under eyes. Next is the concealer. I got the same color. I don't know how much to use. It's thicker than the foundation, but it's still thin. It's not full coverage, but honestly, I've given up on trying to fully cover my under eyes just because my under eyes are so dark. I'm gonna see if I can conceal these little pimples. I'm gonna put here and on there and my chin and on that little zip. Honestly, if I don't look like Selena Gomez at the end of this, what was the point? That just bled- oh my god, this is a dream. It definitely covers like smaller blemishes pretty well. And it not it's not like clinging to my pimples because I use the ColourPop Pretty Fresh Concealer usually and it kind of like clings to the dry spots on my pimples and this is not doing that. Selena, you've done it. I'm gonna put on this lip balm I got, the With Gratitude Dewy Lip Balm and Empathy. I haven't seen anybody shade like swatch this one. It looks so pretty and also I'm an empath so I was like, yes. Oh, that's pigmented. Uh, okay, I'm in. I, yep, love it. I got two of the Soft Pinch Dewy Liquid Blushes. I wish I was being dramatic. Like, I am a very dramatic person, but I'm not being dramatic when I say this is freaking incredible. So I got two shades. 
told you. So I got two shades. I got Joy, which is the dewy formula. Bliss. I got Bliss, which is the matte formula. So I think I'm gonna use Joy. Or should I use both? No, I'm gonna use one. Or do I use both? No, I'm gonna use one. Okay. That's probably way too much. Yeah, that was definitely too much. But it blends like a dream. I like a lot of blush though, so honestly, I'm gonna leave it like that. I'm gonna add bronzer so I don't look as crazy, but on it, I think the blushes were what I was most excited for, which is why I bought two. Because I really wanted a blush in this color, and everybody said that the matte one was still really, really nice. So I bought both because um self-control. I don't know her. This outsold Glossier Cloud Paints by a landslide. Oh, it's so pretty. I look like I just, I was sun-kissed. I just like, went to the beach. Even though we're in a pandemic, so wear your masks. Concealer does crease under my eyes, but I have under eye wrinkles at the ripe age of 23. So I can't blame the concealer. So I'm gonna set my T-zone. I'm used to my makeup taking a lot longer, but this literally is so easy to use. It really does just like, fly by because it blends so easily stab myself in the eye good job liz oh god if my eye starts watering and i ruin this makeup no 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 go back in my eye i need the tear to go back in go back in we're not crying okay i'm gonna put on some bronzer i didn't set where i put the blush so we'll see how this goes works like a dream not surprised I just love Selena Gomez. Selena Gomez, if you're out there and you've never done anything wrong in your life. I feel like a lot of people were nervous because it's like, oh, celebrity makeup line, it's not gonna be good. People, like, people just do it for money. But Selena Gomez has never let me down, like she, literally never. So what made people think she'd let us down this time? I wanna take this foundation off just so I can put it on again. So good. Highlight, I didn't pick up the highlight because I bank account, you know, um, I had to have some form of self-control. Rare beauty, please put me on your PR list. There's nothing rare about me. Um, I went off camera and I did like a little wing. I just popped on some mascara. Um, like I said, I didn't get the eyeliner from her, but I really wish I did. I wiped off the lip balm and my lips are really soft. It is time for the Lip Souffle Matte Lip Cream. And I got it in the shade Inspire because it said it was Selena's favorite and she looked so pretty in the picture. And I was like, I wanna look like Selena Gomez. I watched her video in the tutorials and she said that it's, it's designed so that like the tip is kind of flat so that you can like line your lips, so. It feels like nothing. What? This, it feels like, like a, like a pillow. It doesn't, it doesn't like dry down fully, so like you can't go around kissing anybody, but like I'm not going around kissing anybody. I love everything. I love Selene Gomez. She's never done anything wrong in her life. She's never disappointed me, ever, in any aspect of her career. Music, never. Movie, never. TV, never. This, never. Yeah, that's my review. I don't know what else to say besides my review is like literally like the highest star rating possible because it's so good. I also really like this lip balm, so it's not like a balm, it's just like full ass lipstick, but I'm not mad at it. I love everything, it's so good. Which is bad because now I want more and my bank account can't handle more. Thanks for watching, I don't know if this was helpful, but yeah, you guys said you wanted to see this, so I did it. I just realized I could like zoom you in. I literally look airbrushed, let me just... Thanks for watching, Selena Gomez, I love you, um, and I love you guys with my whole heart, and I will see you in my next video, whenever that is, because I don't know what I'm uploading, so, bye!